Hello, Ben here from Meku, and this is the Meku form box. It's a compact vacuum former, great for teaching STEM subjects, and we're going to run through how it works. These are the control dials for the timer and the temperature of the heater. Turning the temperature dial clockwise turns the machine on and starts warming the heater to the selected temperature. The LED will flash orange whilst the heater is heating up and go green when it has reached the correct temperature. The timer dial can also be set to the designated time found on Meku sheet packs. The timer can be activated by pushing the timer start button. The handles lift the trays up and down. They also act as strong clamps that hold a sheet of material in place between the top and the bottom tray. Clamp the handles back together firmly to create an airtight seal between the trays. Make sure the roller on the underneath of each handle goes under the bottom tray to make a very secure hold. The trays slide smoothly up and down the poles. To click them into place at the top of the machine, lift them up, place your thumbs on the cover and pull the handles up until you hear an audible click. There are currently two types of Meku sheet available for use with our STEM lesson plans. Meku form is white, opaque, and measures 0.5 millimeters in thickness, has a smooth finish, perfect for painting in bright colors. It is ideal for teaching science, maths, engineering, and other STEM subjects. Meku cast is transparent, food safe, and also 0.5 millimeters. It is an excellent material for transparent applications and ideal for teaching casting, manufacturing principles, as well as recycling. To insert a sheet, gently lift the top tray up and click into place. Insert the sheet and line it up with the edges of the silicon seal. Push the top tray down and clamp the handles firmly into place. Make sure that the handles are clamped beneath the two trays. Lift both trays up to the top of the machine and click into place directly under the heater. There is a whole wealth of online resources, including lesson plans, on the Meku website. For this example, we will use the aerodynamics lesson from the STEM pack. In this lesson, we will use a form sculpted from clay, but the form box works great with other machines in your STEM lab. Students can 3D print, laser cut, mill, or make a form purely by hand. Place the object to be formed in the center of the form box bed. Press the timer start button to start the countdown. You'll hear the timer start to click faster when your sheet is almost ready. The sheet should feel like cling film when you tap it and you should look for a slight bowing. To bring the trays down, give them a light, fast tap with the palms of your hands, then bring them calmly down over the form. The vacuum will switch on automatically for 10 seconds. You can shut the vacuum off during this time by pressing the timer start button. Leave the sheet to cool for a few seconds, then release the handles to remove your form. Once cool, you can pop the shape out from the mold and trim the excess material. You can also use form box molds to cast multiple objects. Perfect for teaching students about manufacturing techniques and making sure everyone has something to take home. And you can cast in a wide variety of materials, including plaster, soap, chocolate, and concrete. All 3D printable files are available on the MakeU website, and we're constantly updating the online resources with new and exciting projects for teaching and learning STEM. Be sure to check back often and send us any ideas of what subjects you'd like to see covered. The Formbox also has some built in safety features to take note of when working with students. There are three vents on the top and sides of the machine, which should never be obstructed. If the form box is left switched on and unused, a pre-warning alarm will sound after 10 minutes and the machine will shut itself off completely after 15 minutes of inactivity. We hope you and your students enjoy using the form box. Don't forget to share what you make with us and drop us a line if you have any questions.